Hey guys, Rob Baldwin here, IMX Productions, 10 Minute Design. Okay, today we're looking at Suicide Squad Joker Face Photoshop Tutorial. So, we're gonna take uh, Jared Leto's Joker here, the frame from the end of the trailer that just leaked, which looks awesome. And we're gonna basically Photoshop this onto a photograph. So, I'm using my typical, if you've seen my videos, you've seen this photo before, John's hilarious silly face this is my colleague John Purchase and we're gonna Photoshop him to look like the Joker here okay let's get to it so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna make that face pale and dark and Joker like now if we look at his face right now it's not as as white and kind of as makeup-y as uh, past Jokers have been if we look at uh, Jack Nicholson or Heath Ledger's Joker they had actual makeup he just looks kind of more sickly and pale so that's what we want to achieve so, what I'm going to do is I'm going to select part of the skin right here. I'm going to come down here, get a hue and saturation. We're going to desaturate that skin a little bit. Now again, we don't want it too desaturated. We just want it pale and sickly, kind of. Maybe like this, maybe up. There we go. I think that looks pretty cool. Okay, now we've got option delete, and that will make it all black. So now we can grab a brush, hardness down, opacity at 100, size, bring it up. I'm going to fast forward here because I'm just going to go around and draw all of the skin. Next step, we're going to make the hair green. So what we want to do is make a new layer. Come down here, new layer. We're going to pick a green color, fairly dark. And then same idea, we're going to grab that brush again, make sure it's low hardness, maybe lower. No opacity, we don't have to bring it as high, and we're just going to draw over the hair. Now what we want to do is set it to overlay this way. Okay, and then we're going to draw. Okay, so I've done all the obvious stuff, so what we want to do now is, is drop everything really, really low, and we're going to drop the opacity quite a bit. And then we want to just go over and blend. So just go over the edges very lightly. See how we're just, you don't have to get actually everything. You just want to get very close. And we're just doing a blend at this point. Okay, we got our green hair. Now, you might think it's too green, too flashy, so we can slim, we can lower the opacity a little bit to the point where we think it looks realistic enough. If you're too much, too flashy, you can always lower the, the saturation of the layer as well. Going back to our Jared Leto photo right here, um, he doesn't appear to have any eyebrows, so we're gonna do that as well. So what we wanna do is on this photo, I grab the healing brush, very small, we're gonna sample right above the eyebrows and then draw right below and we're essentially going to erase the eyebrows. All right, we wanna darken around the eyes. What I'm gonna to do to darken around the eyes is I'm gonna go come down here, get a curves, and we just wanna drop this, drop, whoop, just drop the curves to make everything dark. We're then gonna fill that in black to make it go away. Grab a brush, fairly high, low hardness, and then we just start drawing in those dark circles around the eyes. You can go as heavy or as strong as you want. Again, again for this this Joker, as opposed to the um, as opposed to the Jared Leto or the Jack Nicholson, it doesn't look as much makeup as it looks just kind of a sickly look. So we're not going too strong, too makeup-y. We're just going, you know, dark, sickly look um, bags around the eyes. That's looking cool. Okay, next, those teeth. We want grills in there. <laughs> so we look at the picture here, we got the grills. So I found this photo of some grills online. So all we're going to do is we're going to very loosely, and I mean loosely, it doesn't have to be perfect, we're going to select the top grills, copy that, bring it into our photo, 
here we're just going to align it really close with the teeth and what we can do from here is hit warp and then we just try to make it fit it's not going to fit perfect but that doesn't matter just for the purposes of this tutorial here that's going to work okay now what we do is add a mask same as before fill that mask black zoom in here a little bit and then all we do is we draw in certain areas where we want make sure the hardness is actually kind of high on this one where we want those grills to appear right on top of our subjects teeth just like that we can actually make these a little darker too because we want them there we go that's looking pretty good let's do the bottom grills same technique I'm gonna loosely select okay we're looking pretty good last thing we're gonna do is this little um, joker uh, tattoo right here this any tattoos um, we can probably actually just take it directly from the Jared Loto photo you can grab anything really make it a little bigger we're gonna put it right there we're gonna warp it so it just matches his kind of his cheek a little better from here we're going to we're gonna set it to darken and we just want to we're just gonna up the contrast of it a bit so up that lower the darkness here What we're doing is we're trying, we're up in the contrast, we're trying to match the skin color to his skin color. So what we're going to do here is adjust the color balance. And we're going to make it more just moving it around till it matches. From here, mask, same as usual. Grab a brush, we've set it to darken, and then we're just going to remove. Go around and just remove the outer skin color, leaving behind most, if not all, of just that tattoo. Lastly, we're just going to drop the opacity ever so slightly. There we go. Cool. All right. So here we go. We've transformed our photo of John into Jared Leto's Joker. Okay. A few simple methods. We went through the skin, the hair, uh, the eyes, the teeth, and then finally the tattoos. Okay. Hope you've enjoyed that, guys. Um, click here. You can check out how we've turned John into a Chiss from Star Wars. You can click here to see how we created the title. Um, the title from Avengers uh, Infinity War. So a lot of cool tutorials. Please check out the channel. Subscribe. Uh, check me out on social media. Check our website below. Thanks for watching, guys. Cheers. We'll see you next time.